So the 80 plus player pick is out. I'm going to show you how to grind it and how you can get the most player picks for basically no effort whatsoever. Open up our first one here. So get ourselves three duplicates. Now, if you like me to get duplicates, I recommend taking the 83 so you can do the 83 times 10. I've already done it on another video, but I'm going to take it anyway. Now, to grind this player pick, you're going to need, the obviously, the 80-plus player pick in your favorites. You're going to need to have this daily gold upgrade. So I'm going to go ahead and complete the bronze and silver segment of it. You need to use bronze commons off leagues. If you don't know what that means, it means, basically, bronze commons is this one. Off leagues are going to be teams that don't go into the premium mixed league SPC upgrade or the mixed league SPC upgrade. So I'm going to go ahead and complete this off camera now. So something a little bit like that. Now, that's going to give you six bronzes back. So if you do this three times a day, you should only have to put in 22 bronzes that you have in your club. The other 12 that you get are going to be from these packs from SPCs. So again, do the exact same thing. Use silver commons, not rares. And then we are going to go ahead and use all the off-league cards again. So I'm going to go do that off-camera one more time. So again, all of these cards are silver common and they're off leagues. We don't need to use them for any other league SPC or anything like that. These are fantastic for these. Now, I'm not going to do it again, but you should do that three times a day. The maximum you can do it. It's going to give you this gold 11 players pack. Now, this gold 11 players pack may be untradeable, but it's going to be the best value pack you ever have because of what you need to put in to get it. So if we scroll over to our packs and whenever we find it here, 11 gold players pack. Now, every single player in this pack will have some sort of value to it. Even though it's untradeable, it will have some sort of value. So let's go have a look what we have got from this pack. So, for example, League SBC, League SBC, League SBC, League SBC can be used for an upgrade, upgrade, or player pick in this situation. League SBC, player pick, League SBC, League SBC, and then we have ourselves a duplicate 82 that can also be for a League SBC. So let me go ahead and explain to you what I mean by League SBC and what I mean by upgrade. So if we go over to my favorites, because they're always there, we have our premium mix. So... All of these ones, Premier League, La Liga, you want to go ahead and put your duplicates in. Sudamericana, Libertadores, and Self-Explanatory. Liga and Air Divisa used to be really, really difficult. Now it's become unbelievably easy. And let me show you how I do it now. So I go through every single club to see which ones I have five of. And when I find one that I have five or even six of or more, I then go and buy the last card I need. So, for example, PSG could be one. We've got one, two, three, four, five. Then I could use either an 84 if I wanted to. I probably won't do that. Marseille's a no-go. Leon's three. So you see what here? We're just going through, seeing which ones we have the most of. Now, once you've got all of the five or four cards that you have, buy the last one. And I'm just going to go ahead and skip that step now. So you can go ahead and use bronze and silvers if you want. So here we go, Monaco. So we're going to go ahead and put all of these cards in. I'm not going to put the bronze and silvers in because what we're going to do now is we're going to go ahead and got our six gold cards in. We need one more. So we need to put bronze and silver in. There we go. I miscounted. Apparently, I don't know how to count. So there we go. We're going to put this one in here. And now we are going to go ahead and try and get the chemistry off this. Once you have the chemistry, your job is so easy. So the chemistry is done. All you're going to do now is switch over to the error divisi. And you're going to go from low to high. And you're going to go ahead and put in the missing five players. Now, you don't need to put your rares in. You can use your rares for other things. But this is how easy this one has become now. Because you can use so many bronzes before. It was by one team that had the most goals because they were always the cheapest. And now you can see we completed it with five bronzes, one silver and five golds. All from packing and from doing the league SBCs and grinding. Now, this gives us a tradable pack back. With this tradable pack, I'm going to explain what to do with that. So, with this tradable jumbo gold pack, you're going to want to head and sell and discard everything you have. We have to sort out our duplicate first. So, I'm going to go ahead and do another player pick quickly. So, here is our other player pick. I do believe it can go in. Let's see what we get out of this. Hopefully, we only get three duplicates. We don't, luckily. So, we're taking 83 there. Always try to take the highest rated. Well, one is FC24 has more packs in the store than I've ever seen. We have evolutions that cost you coins and points. Kit objectives that cost you coins and points. I have the perfect solution for you. Head over to u7buy.com. Select how many coins you want to purchase. Select your payment method. And don't forget to select add discount and put in code NANIC for that 6% off on all orders. Link will be down in the description. It's going to help you with your league SPC. But going back to the pack, as I mentioned... The Jumbo Gold Pack, you're going to go ahead and sell and discard everything out of this pack. Now, when I say discard, I'm talking contracts, chem styles, TFOs, etc. that aren't worth anything. Sell everything else as well. So we're going to sell all of these players here. We're going to discard the contracts that they don't sell at the moment. Check our chem styles if they sell. Check the kits and everything else. I'll be right back once that's all done. So there you go. That's all been discarded and sold. Now, the reason why you do that, because that's going to keep your coin balance kind of semi-level until you basically pack something crazy good. Now, moving back to the League SBC again, we're going to go over to our last one here for this one, which is going to be Libertadores and Sudamericana. Now, again, if you're doing the grind a lot, you're going to get a lot of Libertadores and a lot of Sudamericana. So how I like to do this one now is I go down to whichever one I think I have the least of first. So this guy can go in and this silver can go in and this silver can go in. And then we're going to go back to Libertadores and we're going to look to try and put one of each club in. You can't have any more than one of each club. So always try and pick the highest rated of each club you have. 
One, for obvious reasons, to get the rating up as high as you can. But also, make sure that you've got golds in there. And you don't need to worry about chem as much. Now, the reason you don't need to worry about chem as much is I'll show you in a second. So, this is what it kind of looks like at the moment. We're going to do some shuffling around here until we can get some chemistry either way. And then, essentially, once you've got the chemistry, you can go ahead and put silvers and bronzes into the rest of this to get this done. Now, hopefully, you can play CDM. We can. So, the chemistry's been done. We're on 69 rated. Now, if I set this to low to high now... And make sure we pick different teams. So this team can go in, this one can go in, and this one can go in. Now, I know they're all silvers, but they all would have been packed from doing the league SBCs and any other upgrades that I've been doing along the way. And as you can see here, that one's been done, but we've got one from the same club. Now, this is why you need to make sure you're not putting players in from the same club, which is going to be the striker here. So we are going to go ahead and take him out. And we're going to go back to the low to high again and have a look which one we need to get, which could be this player here. Hopefully, we don't have him already. doesn't look like it. Yes, we do. So I'm going to go ahead and find the last one that I need. Which in the end was a bronze suit American. So we've got a bronze in there, a load of silvers, and a few golds. Now, this has been complete. It's going to give you five packs all together for completing everything. So one for each segment and then one for completing everything overall. I'm going to show you what to do with your untradeable packs and why this is why the grind is so good once you get into full swing of thing and you learn everything. Because with our untradeable packs, we scroll away, we've got ourselves a prime electric players pack which is from completing the Libertadores and Sudamericana SPC that we just did that you saw on screen. Now this pack, even though it's untradeable, it's the same theory. Everything has value. So that can go to 83 times 10. A player pick, League SPC, League SPC, League SPC, Silver Icons. So Silver Rares can go into Icons or the Bronze or Silver Rare requirements. Then we have a League SPC, an upgrade, League SPC, a League SPC, and then we have ourselves another Premier League upgrade. So with our Endo, for example, who's an untradeable, if you don't have enough Premier League and La Liga players to do this SPC, then go ahead and put him into a player pick. But if you do, go back straight over to the Premier League SPC, go to Premier League and, and La Liga, and go ahead and put your Endo in and go get that one complete. So as you can see here, Endo's been put in and we've got ourselves the chemistry. Now these last four situations, I like to actually use La Liga, not Prem. The reason being is I just need to get a couple rares and a squad rating, so it's not too difficult. So we're just going to go ahead and put in a few of our 82 rated cards. Maybe overkill. Normally, if it wasn't for the video, I'd go through and check every single position just to make sure I'm not overkilling it and going too far over the rating. So we are very far over the rating, but just for this video purpose, we'll go ahead and do it. So our endo has been recycled. That's going to give us a small rare players pack untradeable. This also has an 82 plus guarantee in it, which is going to help you complete everything else. So we back off and go to a store again. There is our pack for completing the Premier League and La Liga. And then we get this pack at the end of it for completing the entirety of the league. SBC. once I find it. Just got to scroll through all my packs to find it. So let me go ahead and find it. Here it is. Small prime players pack. Now this is a really, really good pack to get for doing the grind in general to help you complete higher rated SBCs and much more. You saw that Endo's gone back into our club as well. So let's go ahead and open up our prime gold players pack. It's going to be 12 gold, 6 rare, 182 plus guaranteed. It looks like possibly Trent. It isn't. It's going to be uh, Trippier, unfortunately. But again, an 84 can go towards a team of the week player pick. An 85 can also help. That's an 84 tri uh, Trippier, sorry. So they can go to the 83 times 10. And then again, uh, a, a player pick, a league SBC player pick, player pick, league SBC, league SBC player pick, and a player pick. So we've got a lot of player pick fodder here. Then we've got ourselves an 85 tradable. We should get rid of an 83 and an 80 and a 79. Now, they can both go back into the league SBC or they can both go back into any of the upgrades you want. But just to show you again, we're going to do one more player pick. So in this video alone, we've done three player picks with minimal effort. Now, if you don't have bronze or silvers, there will be a video in the comment section down below. It's about 20 minutes long. I know it's long, but it basically breaks down every single step you need to take from having no budget to a very high budget to a very low budget to having nothing in your club to having lots of things in your club. Like I cover every single aspect of the grind, essentially. So if you want to learn how to do that, that's going to be the best place to go as we go ahead and complete our last player pick now. I am going to go ahead and make 50 of these on the video. So if you want to see if these are worth it before you fully go to grind, give me like 30 minutes max to come back about half past seven UK time. And that video will be uploaded as we go and open up our last pick. And we get an 83, Jorginho. Any questions, comment down below. If you do, chance, smash the like button, subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one.